So. What was the longest contract you ever had then? I had a three. I had a three-year deal, but yep. uh, it's all based on if you if you look at it all, it's all based on guaranteed money, right? Okay. So you look at these deals that you see on you know ESPN and stuff, and it's like quarterback Joe Burrow signed a five-year, two hundred fifty million dollar deal, but a hundred and twenty of it, it's completely guaranteed, and that's what you really right. after. Like mm. as any player, no matter how big or small it is, that's what you're really after. So I signed a three-year deal, but nothing was guaranteed. So meaning that they could genuinely cut me at any time they like and they don't have to pay me oh. a cent. So what does yeah. so what does the word contract mean? You can't, well, you can't go elsewhere. It's a great question. It means nothing. Right. For someone like me, it means completely nothing. For someone like Joe Burrow, so it means ev- it means everything. So it's yeah, it's bizarre. But they have to do it because it's still your job. Does that yeah. make sense? So a contract always has to be signed because it's your job. But Technically, it protects it, them, not you. Exactly. Yeah. It protects them and doesn't protect you. So my my agent obviously does his work to try and get a little bit. So there's other things that you try and work into your contract to get some form of guaranteed cash. When, but when it comes down to it, I find that they really, can cut you at any time and it doesn't make it It's unbelievable. Yeah. As, you know, you got, you got future plans. Yeah. You've got a family. You That's might right. have a mortgage. You, you yeah. need to work out investments and stuff. Yeah. Um, how do you get paid? Like how how is the process for... NFL players, I don't know if it's different for, like, you're a punter. Mm. Um, like, how do you actually get paid? Is it once a year or is it yeah, every six nah. months? Yeah, no, so it's a, it's a weekly thing throughout the season. So you do you do yeah. it like most other people do, you know, as part of the contract stuff. You just – you get paid weekly. Um, and, yeah, it's basically as how long you can go for. It's well and truly. <laughs> yeah. That is it's just well and truly just as how long as you can go for. For, for people in my situation, yeah. and, there's, and there's a lot of them, like – a lot of people in my situation that are just grinding it out, doing one, two-year deals with no guarantee and stuff, but just working their backside off to make it work. And, um, yeah, that's 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 just all there is to it. And you're not getting like, you know, like in the AFL, like a match payment. You're not getting that as well? No, or? well, essentially, essentially it's um, each game that you play is obviously – the money, like the money that you make for the week. Does, yeah, okay. does that make sense? Yeah, so, yeah essentially it is a, ma- it is a match So it's payment. not like so just because you're on the list, you're yeah. not get, are you saying if you don't play, you don't get paid? No, if I, if I, if I don't, if I don't play on there, then I'll get like a less, like a, a lesser amount. So yeah. I'll still get a little bit, gotcha. but yeah, I've yeah. got to play, got to yeah. play. But in my situation, I never really thought about that because I knew I was playing because they never have more than one like punter on yeah, the roster. So it's course. like, I'm either playing or I'm not, or I'm not even on the team. That that's just how it works for me. So that mm. was my, that was my yeah. mindset going into it. But for other for other guys, if you're not playing, then yes, you're still getting you're still getting paid. Like you're mm. still part of it. Fifty three man roster is, you're you're on the active roster, the and books. that's how you that's how you're in the books, and that's fine. Um, yeah, but I I was weird because I never really thought about because I knew I was playing every single week because I was the only guy. But if I wasn't playing, then I wouldn't even I like I just wouldn't be part of the organization because they'd cut me. It's not like they'd go, oh, we'll give you a rest this week. Yeah. We'll yeah. bring somebody else in, but you'll be right for next yep. week. It's a bit of a do or die yep. situation. Yeah. How do you, like, and I'm just thinking even in your personal life and especially for your fiance at the time, you know, wife, how do, how do you, how do you guys settle? Because like we've had NBA players or ex NBA players on the show and one minute they're in Dallas, next minute they're in Chicago, all over the place. Yeah. You've gone Alabama, Detroit, Philadelphia, three very different places. Yeah. You don't Even, settle is the best way to yeah, describe yeah. that. Like, yeah. she, like, <laughs> that's what I thought you you'd don't. say. Yeah, but you like, don't. Can you, you do so as you best you can invest? in that. But like, do you invest in um, property? I mean, I, you... Look, I, again, it probably comes back to the confidence thing that you guys spoke about too. And it's just about believing in yourself and having that confidence to do it. Now, um, in the back of your mind, like a little bit, it's like, yeah, you know, like you know that there's a risk behind this and you're like, there's a chance that it can go at any day now. Um but at the same time, I'm like well and truly backing myself in to be able to get this job done and um, just continuing just to play week by week and play and play good football. Do, so do what you guys I need to? So, yeah. So do you guys then like do you rent a place? Yeah, we just I just rent it. That's yeah, all okay. I do. Yeah. So yeah. I just go in and rent, find a place that I need to. Um, the good thing is, is that each organisation have a plenty of contacts to sure. be able to reach out to and make them aware of your situation. So it's like, yep, he signed something but none of it's like guaranteed could be out. So you find places that they've built relationship with within the area and go, yep, no worries. So if anything goes wrong, yeah. it's like you don't have to pay any extra gotcha. with breaking a lease early and things like that. So um, you can feel good about it, like knowing that if there's no reward at the end, that like there's not, you're not going to be suffering mm. afterwards. Yeah. Um, but 
yeah, I mean, I just my mindset. It's it might sound a bit bizarre, but it just my mindset was just like you've done it for a while. You like just back yourself in and get yeah. it done, and and you know the rest will work out for itself. And we were able to make that work for a few years, which was excellent. And um, yeah, it was yeah, it was good. Yeah, it was good. What's the um? What was the first thing you purchased or bought? <laughs> I'm sure you get asked that a lot. And then what first thing for yourself? I'm trying to remember. For yourself, yeah. seeing, I'm sure the contracts look very different from your time in the AFL to, to the NFL. Yeah. What was that feeling like actually going, holy shit? Yeah, it was pretty sick. Yeah. 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 I, mean, yeah. I love hearing that. That's what we like, don't know. Like, yeah, we, it was amazing. Yeah. Like, I just, yeah, to be honest, I'd never had that amount, like, go into my bank account in one, like, one Crazy transaction. Crazy. I was like, fuck. <laughs> <laughs> Let's fucking make this as long as we possibly yes. can. Let's fucking yeah. do this. Bloody so, honest, mate. Um, that was that was pretty that was pretty yeah. cool. I yeah. can't I can't deny that. But um, how much was it? Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah. I can't go that far. No, 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 oh, no, no, no. <laughs> that was good though. I reckon I almost was like, yeah, no, yeah, you gotta, second, you gotta try. But, um, yeah. No, nah, that was that was pretty amazing. But um, probably the first thing that comes to mind that I I I did like splurge on myself was like a genuine good set of golf clubs. Like, Ooh. got my own set um got fitted everything like that like (laughs) so i I went and invested myself like making sure that because i i I enjoy my golf so i gotta like if i'm gonna play it i may as well try and do it so that was that was pretty cool that was my first little one and then um yeah basically um just tried to just save as much as i possibly could so i can get something back here in terms of property wise which was good too and yeah did that but um no certainly when the first paycheck got in after that when you actually make when you make the team so in detroit i was on the on the practice guy which was still which was still good money um but making the actual roster and playing actual games i was was like fuck and is is, it a cheaper way of living over there or is it more expensive depends where you are yeah um i'd say for the most part it was still pretty expensive Yeah. yeah um Living in, if I lived like living in Alabama, certainly like not as much, but living in the big cities like Detroit, um, Philadelphia, and that, yeah, still, still quite expensive. 